It's me. My day felt like it dragged for the longest time. I don't think I can actually properly word just how freaking relieved I am to be home. Babe? Hello? Marco? Polo? <laughs> hmm, where could they be? I swear, if you're in there playing that ghost hunting game for the zillionth time and getting all big scared, well, frankly, you deserve it for playing it in the dark like a psycho. <laughs> oh, you're sleeping. And my big mouth didn't wake you? <laughs> I couldn't even imagine being that deep of a sleeper. Ugh. You look so cute and comfy and just peaceful like that. I think I am just going to have to squeeze in here and do a cuddle with you. There we go. Mmm, you're so warm. Let me just wrap my arms around you. Well, hello there, sleepyhead. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to wake you. I couldn't resist climbing in here. Oh, baby, you used that super fruity scented shampoo tonight, didn't you? My god, <laughs> if I could just envelop myself in a smell, it would be this one. It's just you in a cute little nutshell. Oh, sweetie, go back to sleep. Well, yeah, I feel bad now for waking you. Oh, you think it might help if I talk you to sleep? And that whispery voice that you I mean, I guess that's the least that I can do after waking you up so rudely. Okay, you. I want you to just get nice and comfy in my arms. Mm hmm. The cuddle monster has been activated, and it yearns for the cutest of cuties to cuddle with. Did I say yearn? I'm sorry, I must have misspoke. The cuddle monster is doing a demand. <laughs> oh, there's that sweet little smile of yours. Baby, are you blushing? Yes, <laughs> I know it's dark in here, but I can practically feel the heat from those cheekies. Mm -hmm. <laughs> There's basically a very small little campfire on your face, just in case you didn't realize. Now, shh, let me get back to softly cooing you to sleep, sweetie. Oh, I haven't even started with the cooing. Fine. Coo. Coo. <laughs> You're right. I'm ridiculous. 
ridiculously happy having you in my arms right now. Even more happy feeling your breathing slowly getting slower. Hearing you starting to take deeper, more rhythmic breaths. Listening to you inhale. And exhale. Matching my breathing to yours. Which will cause both of us to relax more and just sink more into this bed. Into each other's arms. You want to know what one of the best things is about this? About crawling into bed and getting all cuddly with you? It's knowing that I'm going to be waking up to you. So, like, it's almost like a race at this point, you know? Because the best part of my day is waking up with you in my arms. But also, the best part is falling asleep next to you. You're basically the first and last happiest moments of each and every day. <laughs> Would you like to hear something funny? Well, like... With this train of thought, what's funny is I wake up thinking, oh no, the highlight of my day is already almost over, and the day hasn't even really begun. Then, every night, somehow, I'm always surprised that the best part of my day is falling asleep wrapped up in each other. So, conundrum. <laughs> I know, it's just a forever downward spiral. See how many problems you cause me. <laughs> You're right. I wouldn't change a single thing about that. I'm... The luckiest girl in the whole entire big wide world. Now, shh. I'm just going to stroke your hair. Give you a nice and comfy little scalp massage. Does this feel good, baby? Good. I want you to feel the best right now. You should feel so calm and relaxed. The sleepy should be hitting you any time now. Mm-hmm. <laughs> You've got a one-way ticket to Sleepy Town, cutie. Just do me a favor and listen to my voice, yeah? I want you to know just how much I care for you. How cherished you are. How loved you are. That's right. You are loved. You are safe. You are secure. You are protected. Me. <laughs>
Mm, this is definitely the best part of 